Job done, pal. Impressive, Ernesto. Incredibly destructive, but impressive. Now get the Papa Morty files out unseen. Unseen? Me? Just try and be restrained. Just this one. There's a telegraph line from the top of the pyramid to the jungle landing strip. We'll be waiting for you there. much longer. You can run, but you can't hide, hombre. Should have done that job blindfold. Would have been more of a challenge that way. You've always been fast, Ernesto. But maybe you should try exercising your brain sometimes. <laughs> Papa Muerte thanks you for your hard work. Commander Trust, sir. My father didn't die of an overdose. It was a plot created by Papa Muerte with one of our own agents. And the agent is still operating from within these walls. Now listen, Cruz. Your father's death came as a shock to all of us. But to accuse another agent is a serious allegation. You better have something to back this up. Okay. It all started two weeks ago. After hearing nothing about my father's murder for years, I get a hot lead. I befriended Marco, a local small-time crook who wanted a favor. He told me that Cesar Morales, local gang boss, full of tequilas one night, had bragged of knowing about my father's death. Hola, mano. If you do this job properly, it will get you undercover in the Cesar Morales cartel. Gracias, Marco. I'll owe you one. Está bien, mano. Take this truck and ram it into the Virgilio's convoy, and when the job is done, meet me at El Macho Bar.
Cruz here. Everything is A-OK -okay on my first job as a gangbanger. Good. Now open the door and get ready to jump ship before you hit the tanker. This was a once-in-a-lifetime lead. Agents Pearson, Andreasen, Johnson, and Colding had all put a lot of work into this. I couldn't help feeling I'd let everyone down. So run it past me again. Who got the bright idea to send in your idiot twin brother? I can't remember exactly who came up with it, but feeling guilty and all, I went along with the whole crazy idea. To let my idiotic brother out of jail in exchange for him taking my place as an undercover agent. Ram. Yes? It's Tommy. Listen, man. Neither of us want you to be there. But you're there. So let's just try to get along. No, let's not. Let's cut the brotherly love for Just shut up and tell me what to do. Okay, let's just get this over and done with. Your first task is to get some hardware. I've made arrangements with Mr. Mendez from the Mexican Secret Police. He owes me. You'll find him and his buddies in a downtown joint called the Grease Burger. Hola, Señor Cruz. Interesting new undercover look with the beard and all. Anyway, Marco tells me you need something. 
If you need anything else, just come and talk to me, you know. Hey little bro, your first contact is called the Rat, located in the red light district. Find him at a bar called El Mancho. Great. Tell me something, are you going to have this attitude all the way through this mission? Yeah. Thought so. Hola, chica guapa. I'm looking for Marco, alias the rat. You asshole, Cruz. Don't pretend we never met. What was that? I goddamn near lost my nose. And I like it. I like breathing through it. I don't know why I'm telling you this, but your friend, the rat, is playing poker with Los Hermanos Vigilio inside the bar. And apparently, he's winning too much. Whoa, that's Marco. You need him alive. Save his sorry ass. <sighs> Spicy move! Run, amigo! Andale! More are coming! Let's get to my car! Come with me this way, mi amigo! Spicy move! Take the tunnel under the road, amigo. Those crazy spicy move. You are very good with your gun. This way is safe, amigo. Spicy move. Spicy move! There's a side entrance to the big parking structure.
go to the third floor. That's where my car is. Kill the American pig. Oh. Rescue me, Cruz! Help! Bullseye! Over here! Over here, Cruz! Bullseye! Easy, amigo. You drive. I got too many tequilas on me. Hold on, Cruz. So just to recap, your crazy brother is on the loose somewhere out there where he's running about like a lunatic. And if that isn't bad enough, he's working for us. I know what you're saying, sir. But if you'll just let me finish the story, just try and look past the details and see the big details. picture. Details? We're talking about endangering the lives of innocent people. Hey, Ami, what I'm gonna do now is go inside, take my enchilada hangover cure, and get my hair back into maximum padrissimo position. And what about presenting me to your boss? Oh, si, sí, si. Sí. I nearly forget. Okay, see. Sí. Of course I can call the jefecito and say a few nice words, but this won't be enough, gringo. You need to get yourself noticed. Spicy move!
spicy move. Feeling lucky, punk? Caramba! No tengo dinero, no tengo nada. You should be glad I took this scrap off your hands. So, this is the man I keep hearing about, huh? I would shake your hand, but mine is covered in blood. I'm a vegetarian. <laughs> the funny Americano. But us Mexicano boys are not impressed with talk, only action. You really want to prove yourself to me? I guess. I got nothing better to do. You see, Gringo? To a Mexicano, honor is everything. Now I hear about the Vergilios coming into town from their farms, cheating at cards, behaving like beasts. I need to restore my honor. So I got a job for you. My beautiful chauffeur Angel will drop you off at the farm, where you have two goals. First, you will need to smash the fertilizer container and destroy everything you can. Secondly, steal the Virgilio's beloved car and bring it back to me. Comprendis? Better get some wheels, bro. It's quite a walk. Spicy move! Bullseye! 
destroy the fertilizer tower right away. Try to ram or blow up the four steel containers. Spicy move! Spicy move. You've got to get your hands on some heavy duty vehicles or use some explosives for the next three. I'll be back. Oh, Jesus. This isn't a movie, you know. It kind of feels like one. Spicy move. Spicy move! Spicy move!
still have two to go. Spicy move. Spicy move. Spicy move! Spicy move! Spicy move! So many people to kill, so little time. Relax, bro. You still have one to go. Spicy move!
You're worse than trailer trash. You're tractor trash. Bingo! Take your final siesta, pendejo. Spicy move! That blow sure made the tower unstable, but I think you'll have to give it a last push. Spicy move! You're worse than trailer trash. You're tractor trash.
Bro, stop goofing around. Bullseye. Go on to Vigilio's farmhouse. The car is somewhere inside. <sighs> Spicy move! Be cool. This is a robbery. Just shut up. Just give me the car Spice keys and move. no one gets hurt. Okay, I guess not. So much for Mexican hospitality. Hey, if you marry your sister, are you your own kid's uncle? I can't work it out. Hey, asshole! You should have stayed home on your tractor! You're just pissed off because of your shotgun wedding. To your sister! You smelled bad even before you died. Grab the key and get to the garages! Spicy move!
I know careful isn't in your vocabulary, but be careful with that card, because Morales wants it. You're such a spoiled sport sometimes. You know that? Spicy move! Excelente. The Helios car. I'm so glad I risked my ass for that car. You need to learn the language of the streets before playing with the big boys.
spicy move. Spicy move! Bienvenido, amigo. I'm hearing good things about you. Thing is, though, I ain't the only one who heard. Those Virgilios kidnapped Morales' three brand new 18-wheelers. Morales needs the trucks pronto for the traffic of a hundred tons of cocaine. That's a serious stash, man. ¿Qué tal, gringo? Morales wants you to go in there and get the trucks out one by one. My drivers here will then take the trucks back. Ten cuidado. Just take it easy, huh? Me? Take it easy? Let's get this truck back to the pickup point. Spicy move! Those containers look pretty heavy. Spicy move!
spicy move. This sucker too! Spicy move! Spicy move. Spicy move. <laughs> 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 With a head that empty, at least you won't sink. Spicy move!
spicy move. Way to go, cowboy. But just one more thing. Moore wants more. And Morales wants a lot more. He wants that ship. On the bottom of the harbor. So take this truck full of dynamite and dump it into the ship's cargo. Let's blow some shit up! Gotta go. See you later. Spicy move! Spicy move! Okay, Tommy, I'm flying. Yeah, bro, and I'm crying. So give me my one-way ticket back to Venice Beach. Hold on there, kid. It ain't over till it's over. Oh, right. Don't tell me. Just one more thing. Well, one or two. Right. That's pretty funny. Me nearly getting killed and shit. If you're scared, then, hey, let's call it a day. Screw you. I'll do it. But as soon as you guys bust Cesar Morales, I'm out of here. Then my short but hairy career as a DEA agent is over. If I'm still alive. Listen, this is highly confidential. Stay close to those trucks. They're gonna lead a TEA special assault team led by agents Pearson and Johnson in to capture a stash of a hundred tons of coke. That's one hell of a big rock, man. Thank you. 
Ah, mi gringo favorito. Listen, you know the three trucks you recovered? Now, I have to send them through Virgilio territory to a secret location. Go to Marco, he'll give you tools and instructions. Here he is, el hombre. Cesar's giving you a big job, muy importante. Now listen, meet the trucks at the truck stop outside of town. Hey, wait a minute. Morales told me you got some tools for me. Así es. Here you are. This prime piece is a present from Cesar's props mine, Elvis. Oh, uh, and I forgot. Cesar's foxy driver was here asking for you. <laughs> Please be careful, mano. She's too hot for gringos. Oh, yeah? Maybe I'm too cool for her. Not you again! El gringo loco! Let's move! Americano. Looks like you're done here. Now get back to Morales. Nos vemos. Ram, for Christ's sake, 
You need to see where the trucks are going. <sighs> Going, man. Hang in there. Uh oh. Listen. Pearson, Johnson, and their men are outside the factory walls. Get back to the front gate and open it so the assault team can get in. Spicy move. Oh, lots of mad cows in this meat. Spicy move! Spicy move! Hi, Ram. Nice to see you. Good job. We'll have you out of here and back in L.A. in no time. I'll take my men around the side entrance. Secure the area. Secure this DEA, Scott. You're a steak.
Nice move. Spicy move! Spicy move! Spicy move! Spicy move! Spicy move! You got 
Roasted, señor. Spicy move! Spicy move! Spicy move! Spicy move! Electroshock for mad cows? Looks dangerous to me. You're a steak.
Spicy Move. If you're here to buy some ribs, you know what? Don't bother. Put the wisecracks, meathead. Grab this machine gun. We got company. Shoot them before they ram us! Trouble with these country trips, Angel, is all the damn insects swarming around. Clear the road! I should have just stayed on my beach. Nice clothes. You must be a fashion model. So much for Mexican hospitality. Hey, asshole! Go flag your own cab. Dust. Angel, incoming! That was close. You can say that again. Nearly took a big piece of meat out of it. And I like that piece. Right. So your punk brother escapes, and my highly trained officers don't? A bit fishy, don't you think? No. My brother would have ended up like the rest if it hadn't been for his guardian angel. Thanks to our family good looks, a Mexican female police agent managed to get him out before those goons found him. Cruz, is this going anywhere? Pardon me? I mean, we're into my lunch hour now, and all I've heard so far is how your idiot brother has demolished half of Los Toros. Sir, we're getting to the good stuff. Really. This is very important. Believe me, please.
Let's go, amigos. Spicy move. Okay, it's all clear. Are you ready for some action? Sure, I thought you'd never ask. Listen, all the Virgilio Kingpins are meeting at El Macho Bar. I'm guessing high on the agenda is how to kill Cesar Morales. I got that one covered, man. I'm taking that bull by the horns with immediate effect. Ramiro! Carry on. Well, you should get over there and offer your services. What's in it for me? They help you, and they give you information. Yo, cabby, step on the gas over to El Macho Bar. Hello, buddy, we're going to go 
Guerrero. Spicy move. Don't want any disturbance at this little meeting of theirs. Oh, terrific. There's an entrance to the roof of the bar. Go and find it. Roof? You know, nothing's ever simple with you, is it? Spicy move! Live by bullshit, die in bullshit, pendejo. I'm really seeing red now, asshole. Is el gringo loco?
spicy move. Gentlemen, I'm going to make you an offer you can't refuse. Hola, Ram. What's up? Cesar Morales is a puppet, and somebody's pulling the strings. According to the Virgilios, he keeps the secret information in a safe in his headquarters. He carries a key on a golden chain around his fat neck. Cesar Morales' HQ is located in the city bullring. He's chairman of the Bullfight Club, and him and his gunslinging bulls are on some kind of Tex-Mex trip down there. The place is packed with gun-ho, trigger-happy jerks. So, easy, tiger. Yo, Cabby, full speed to Barrio del Toreo. A la corrida te llevo, boy. Spicy move. Spicy move! Ramiro, you got big balls, but no brain. Kill him, boys! The gate is electronically locked. You can open it from inside the ticket office. Spicy move!
Spicy move! Die, gringo! Muere! Hola, Ram. Do you see the gate on the other end of the arena? That's the way into the bull stables where the safe is. Find a way down into the arena. Spicy move! Die, gringo! Muere! Spicy move! Spicy move! Spicy move!
¡Ay, gringo! ¡Muere! Your biggest problem is that you've got big cojones, but nothing in your brain. I think Freud would have had something to say about your obsession with my big cojones. Enough talk. Say hello to my balls. I mean balls. You ridiculous little American kid. You really think you can deal with this prime, this affected baby? Gringo! Muere! It's for setting me up, you big fat pile of bullshit! Hey, Fetzel! Your ass is bigger than my house! I got the key. Great, Ram. Now, go and find a safe in the stables. It's hidden in the floor.
Tommy, much as it pains me to ask for help, I got a problem. This safe is rigged with a friggin' bomb. Okay, take it easy. Do you see the two wires? Yep, a blue and a red. Cut the blue wire. But are you sure? Yes, just cut it. You stupid son of a... It was the wrong wire. It's gone into countdown. Jesus, who's whining now? Just grab the envelope and get out of there. Ready, steady, go! It's a letter to Cesar Morales, signed P.M. Weird thing is, you're mentioned in it. Translate for me. My dear friend Cesar. My dear friend Cesar, our friend in the DEA, the Eagle, has sent us a warning. A freelance agent has infiltrated your organization. His mission is to lead an armed group of DEA agents to the factory. Let him work hard. Let him lead the DEA squad into an ambush, and then kill them all. You will need heavy equipment for the operation. Go to Elvis Autos and get the equipment from his garage. I know you will do your best in this important matter. And finally, it's signed with the initials PM. Listen, you better pay Elvis Autos a visit. And be careful, your face is on posters all over town. For you, I'll do it. Hey Ram, what did you find? Think I'll go and see a guy Elvis. You got something cooking with some mystery dude called PM. They plan to kill you and the other cops. That sucks, man. Elvis? PM? Ramp, this sounds like Papa Muerte. The drug lord dad was after when he died. Whoa, hold on. Are you saying this Papa guy was involved in dad's death? I don't know if he even exists. No one's ever seen this guy. He's like a myth with the criminals down here. Like the devil or something. Listen, if this is just some kind of crazy story to keep well, me... for Christ's sake, how low do you think I would go? Sorry, man. Where's this Elvis guy? I'll help you get in there. But, Ram, if this PM is Papa Muerte, you gotta be careful. 
Careful, like red and blue wires kind of careful, you mean? Listen, that was just... Just let me handle this my way, man. Spicy move!
You're scrap metal, pendejo. Spicy move! Spicy move! Spicy move! Ram, those doors are locked! Must be a key somewhere! Well, this key seems to be pretty important. Spicy move! <laughs> Spicy move! Boom, boom! Hey Tommy, I found some work sketches showing coffins with secret compartments, all signed PM. Coffins? That fits more the style all right. Always does stuff in some freaky way. Looks like someone's been preparing a small war too. There's enough empty weapon boxes to support a small army. I knew it. Something's going down. Something big. See any coffins or weapons? No, everything's gone. Okay, this drill is getting hotter. 
Now it's time to have a little talk with Mr. Elvis. Find out where the coffins and weapons are. Marco should know where to find him. Orale, Ramiro! Mi amigo, you're alive! Whoa, take it easy, buddy. I heard you were there at the meat factory massacre, compañero. So many dead DEA agents. Lucky I'm not a DEA agent then, man. Now I want to find a dude called Elvis. Si, sí, Elvis, comprendo. Uh, problem is that this cat's hacienda is heavily guarded. So you have to get in from the sea without the guards noticing anything. So I'll need a speedboat? Cool beans. Así es. And the Virgilios have one. But nothing is free. I'll call you as soon as I've arranged the boat. Ugh, those farm idiots. Never happy. They wanted you to do more favors, but I said no. And finally, I got this belleza for you, amigo. You're kidding. This is what you got me? Don't sound so disappointed. This baby can do 80 knots, homeboy. Even you won't need to go that fast. Well, I'll be the judge of that. Listen, amigo. You need to make him talk, not make him silent. So, try to get in and out unnoticed. Hola, girls. 
Anybody up for some water skiing? Just let me finish up with Senor Elvis here. Let's just merge into the background there, bro. Well, if you had just waited, I could have told you that Elvis is on the terrace on the other side of the hacienda. Now you gotta go through the garden and find a way down to the sea to get to Elvis. Try the courtyard. Spicy move! Spicy move! Follow the water line. Find a way up to the terrace. <sighs>
There's always one idiot who spoils the party. Hey, bro. The storeroom's kind of creepy. Besides, army surplus is so last year. What do you mean? I just found Agent Pearson and Johnson's jacket and the remains of all the DEA agents. It's pretty sick. Bodies everywhere, man. Spicy move! You bastards. Total lack of respect. You know they were old friends of Dad? I'm gonna make them regret this shit. I don't remember inviting you. I'm a friend of Pepe's. Pepe? Okay, you got me. I'm a gatecrasher. Now you better start talking, pal. Why should I talk to a gringo asshole like you? Because I'm holding a gun in my hand, and you're just holding your Johnson. Hey, mister, that's rude. Talking about my chorizo in front of these girls. Just small talk, pal. Now tell me about the coffins, the bodies, the weapons, and the rest. Hey, I get it. You're the guy who wrecked my car shop, right? That wasn't smart. I don't have time for this. The next bullet might take off a different red end. Okay, okay, take it easy. Papa Muerte ordered me to build the coffins, get rid of some steves, and provide some weapons. That's all I know. I was told that General Montañez would deliver the payment. That's exactly what's happening. Who is this General Grande Mountain dude? I have no idea. Ram, I checked. I, seek. I got just records on General Montañez. I have told you what I know. Okay, Mr. Elvis, thanks for your cooperation. Have a nice day. Cooperation, my ass. This is for my men and the cars you wasted. Okay, girls, show him your bazookas. Oh, nice Speedos. Pity they aren't bulletproof. A word of advice? Don't ever wear those on my beach. Huracan! Ah! Oh! Oh! El Mariachi! That was a hot shot! Llorar, 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 
Dirás que no me quisiste, pero vas a estar Hola, Ramiro. I got good news and bad news. Bad news first. The Mexican police have discovered your position, and someone has informed the military. What? The military? And the good news? Well, at least someone is finally taking you seriously. That's it? Maybe this Papá Muerte Cuate is pulling some strings. We could be onto something big. There's some other dude in on this. Spice High up in the military, called something like General... Shh. Don't give me the name. Somebody might be listening. Give it to me later. Oh! No sé bien que estoy afuera. Pero el día que yo me muera, Spicy Moon. Tendrás que llorar. Llorar y llorar. Llorar y llorar. Dirás que no me quisiste, pero vas a estar muy triste. Y así te vas a quedar. Con dinero y sin dinero. Siempre lo Spicy move. Watch out! You're spilling your mojito, dude! General Montaña, señor. I think I see that gringo bastard's car coming this way. I can wrap you to a trap. Let's finish this game. Raise the bridge! Pero, señor, there are cars on the bridge! No me importa. Screw that. Hey, señor. The suspect is top priority. Whoa, that's gotta be double part. Spicy move! <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. 
Thing that annoys me, it's a Sunday driver. It's my lucky day. You made it. You should have called. What for? I was worried, you jerk. This is serious, can't you see? General Montañez is a high-ranking military general who's worked for both us and the CIA during covert ops. So? The USA has many supporters around the world. But if he used to work for us, and now works for Muerte, that's pretty bad. There's a chance that he's the link between somebody in the DEA and Papa Muerte. Get it? So, we decided that Ram must get into the General's headquarters for more info. And? Did you get the name of the traitor inside the DEA? We found something better. But first things first. Hey, amigo. Ready for the ride of your life? Please tell me this isn't happening. Relax, hombre. Or Lucy and I will take you into the sky. I thought for a minute there you were stoned. And you were flying the plane. Salta, amigo! Jump! Jump! Is there anything I should know before I jump? See? 
put on the parachute and pull the string. Thanks a lot, pal. Graham, your goal is a big, tall ruin with the satellite dish. This is the communication building. Inside, they keep their most sensitive data. We need that data. the king of the jungle not you cabron Mr. Green.
spicy move. There's no power for the satellite controls. I was afraid of that. You'll need to take the elevator down to the generator room in the temple's catacombs. Power up the generator to align the dish. Spicy move! You need to start the generator before you can align the dish. Spicy move! When I'm done with this place, it will be a ruined spicy oh. move. Someone beat me to it. Spicy console move. to power up the generator. Uh. You'll find the controls for aligning the dish back in the first room of the catacombs. After the dish is aligned, you'll be able to transmit the data. You can't kill me. I'm American. Spicy move! Spicy move! Spicy move! Dr. Jones, I presume?
You must be Ramiro, the latest tiresome pest from the Cruz clan of Cockroach. I hear you're the one that feeds on trash and slime, short ass. It's time you got crushed like the rest of the bugs that attack Papa's property. Hey, short ass, show me what you got. Sombrero of death. Hey, General! For someone named after a mountain, you are one hell. Oh. Hey, General! For someone named after a mountain, you are one hell of a tiny bastard. General! For someone named after a mountain, you are one hell of a tiny bastard. Spicy move! See you at the Day of the Dead, bastardos! Okay, flip the switch to align the dish. Okay, the dish is ready. Head back up the elevator to start the upload. I got everything. Get to the airfield now. Go up by the dish and slide down to the airfield. Follow the road out of the camp. It leads down to the airfield.
amigo. They've got the breach blocked off. Looks like you'll have to fight your way through. Spicy move. There are some ugly beasts in this zoo. Spicy move!
escape to the airstrip. Which opens the gate to the airstrip. Spicy move! Hey, gringo! That airfield is defended by anti aircraft gun! Big, angry looking anti aircraft gun! I ain't loco enough to try landing while they can blow me out of the sky! by ramming them with a car or blasting them with weapons fire. I'll keep circling until they're all taken care of. Spicy move! Hey, gringo! I got an idea! I'll distract some of the AA guns and throw away their fire.
Spicy move! You're dead, Mr. Green. Tommy, I'm tired of this. Is it ever going to end? Have some mercy, bro. Okay, I'll go straight to Trust. Tell him everything and get you out. Go to Angel's apartment and wait. And bring Marco with you. We owe him a green card and want him out, too. So this document contains the name of one of my agents who's an informer? Yeah, and a whole lot more. My dear friend, General. Our informant in the DEA has told us that the Gringo Cretans don't destroy the cocaine they have confiscated. They keep it as contraband to be used in their secret wars. Now I want this coke back to sell to the rich white maggots of the Estados de America. And I need your help. Take a cargo train with your best soldiers. At Pueblo del Centro it will be loaded with the coffins of the dead Gringos. Our DEA friend will make sure that the train goes straight into the DEA headquarters through a secret tunnel. Steal the coke and leave. After placing a huge time bomb, nobody will go after you. Nobody will admit that DEA has contraband cocaine. And the beauty of it all is that the cocaine is already inside the United States. Christ on a bike! An attack on the DEA? I'll call the generals.
spicy move. Spicy move! Put the phone down. It's game over, Colonel Trust. And don't count on your brother to make a last-minute rescue cruise. That's one cat all out of lives. You might also be interested to hear that we made plenty of fur fly when we dragged that Mexican bitch off the streets by her cute little tail. And as for you two gentlemen here, oh, we got plenty of fun in store for you, too. Don't do this, Johnson. I, I tell you, you are gonna re... re I never trusted your goddamn trigger-happy cowboy routine, Johnson. But I can't believe this. You think this is gonna work? You won't get out of this building, man. Who's gonna stop us now? You, Ironside? Hey, and don't you think it's weird that both you and your drug addict father die of an overdose? He was no addict. It was you that killed him, you scum. Have a nice trip. Spicy move! Yes, 
su madre! Your parrot food, cabron. At last, you have a purpose. I've done my tour of duty, man. I'm out of here. Now here's a little story that I like to contar. Pendejo que conozco who like to drogar. Started way back in the Mexico City. The year was 97, Malatab was the epitome. Lots of brown nosing was going around. The quarter was crazy, valedores were down. He'd be here to all the parties with the flashy clothes. He gets a little drunk and powder up his nose. He'd be backstage at all the shows. He's not the mock off the show off. Spicy move! Spicy move! Spicy move!
estúpido. I've done my tour of duty, man. I'm out of here. Spicy move!
Sexy Move. Spicy move! Basil.
Tommy! You okay, man? Am I glad to see you, Mr. Pink. I mean, Mr. Ram. Listen, where's Angel? Take this, son. It'll get you down the elevator to the vault. You gotta disarm the bomb. Take care of Johnson, bro. He killed Dad. I know. Spicy move! I'm on it. Close the gates and kill him. Spicy move. Is this another half-assed Mexican attempt to invade the USA? You couldn't even traffic drugs up your own nose, cabrón.
This is gonna shake my Dodgers pictures off the wall back home. Spicy move! Run for shelter! The bomb's gonna explode! Damn! They're not falling for it! Spicy move! Tommy, I found the bomb, but I've got a problem yeah, with this. I know, it's the whole wire thing again. Damn, now what color did we cut before? It's even worse. There's no wires. Great. Maybe? I've got an idea. What if I move the bomb onto the other train and left with a bomb- That might work. You should be able to move it with one of the forklifts.
spicy move. This is gonna blow California right into the air. This is gonna blow California right into the ocean. You guys uh, waiting for the next bus? Come on, the bomb is ticking. This is gonna be nasty. The Morales is ass after chili and frijoles. Sandwiches in the buffet car?
Johnson at any cost. He sent two Harriers to blow up the train. Get off that thing, now! No way, Jose. I gotta save Angel. Put trust on the line. Get off the train, now! You gotta give me a chance to save Angel. You owe me that, and her. <sighs> okay, in about ten minutes, the train will pass over Dead Man's Gorge. You better save Angel and jump off, cause I'm telling the fighters to blow the bridge. <laughs> Keep running, man. You're gonna run out of trains sometime.
Damn it! Will you stop running and fight? My feet are killing me! I'm afraid we must part. It's not you, it's me. <laughs> God damn, son of a. Gracias, Ramito. That was breathtaking. I didn't know you had it in you. Risky, but uh, very exciting. What, the jump or...? Both, idiota. No llores, Angel mío.